Na 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 How you gon' ask your friend to introduce you? How you gon' talk to me like I'm your baby, I'm your new boo? Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. I am doing another hair review video for you. Beauty Forever reached out yet again for me to do their straight hair wig review um if you haven't seen my last wig review i will have a card up here or up here of their 14 inch um curly lace front wig once you open it it's not gonna be this messy but you will receive your wig in this bag i also have a clip of it on this side you will receive another one of these little braided headband thingies and a wig cap i actually did use it but if you're trying to go for a more natural look to have a more natural part this black wig cap ain't gonna do it honey <laughs> and this just came with the wig and this time they actually included their little i guess a brochure it just kind of tells you the pros and cons of having version here versus non-version here and it gives you information about returns and i guess like their little brand ambassador i forgot her name i forgot her name but i do follow her which is kind of crazy and yeah on the back of their box they just have the right way to measure wigs they have different questions that are i guess always ask so they just put it on the back of their box yeah. this is your box um actually i'm gonna keep it right here so if i look down it's because i wrote down the information about this hair <laughs> um i did buy this hair off of amazon i am a prom student so if you are a prom member you will receive this hair in two days so yeah if you go on their amazon website this will be listed as a 13 by 6 lace front wig i do have in 16 inches and it goes past my um bra strap for some reason i was thinking like 16 inches isn't going to be this long but excuse me i'm really liking this length and for all of my true supporters who actually been watching me for a while y'all know i do not wear black hair like who is she right now for those of you that's new watching i literally haven't had like jet black hair since 2013 probably but you know i couldn't just go all out black i had to bleach it a little bit but yeah if you're new here don't forget to subscribe and join the family before you leave so this hair is a very very silky I couldn't even keep it in a ponytail when I was just in the shower. Um, this wig is a 150% density. If you are one of those girls who like your straight hair to be a little bit thicker, then 150 is not for you. <laughs> I'll probably go up. If you are one of those girls, you should probably go up to 180% density. But I mean, for me, it's fine. I really don't wear straight hair like that anyway, so I really don't care. Um, she did come pre-plucked online. It says it's a glueless wig. Now, for me, it's not glueless. I guess just the way their wigs are set up or the way my damn head is set up, it, like, I can't lay it down glueless because this part like kind of like pulls back so any other regular wig like it'll just lay flat like but like of course you can still see the lace but this one it kind of like just bulges up so i use the got to be glue free spray and i usually do two coats around my whole perimeter and then of course the sides usually don't always stay down so i'll do a third coat for the sideburns and that's that but if your head isn't shaped like mine you can probably get away with a glueless install <laughs> and yeah like i said it is 16 inches a and the wig was only a hundred dollars and 71 cents who got a better price for a 16 inch lace front wig period <laughs> but yeah 
I did use a coupon that they have on Amazon. Once you use that coupon, it took $10 off of my order. So I advise you to use a coupon. It's usually right under the price and it'll be like 8% coupon, 10% coupon, something like that. Just make sure you check the box and then once you go to order, you'll see, you know, what your coupon was. But yeah, fast two-day shipping. Coupon code save $10. It's like... It can't get no better than that. But, like I said, it was pre-plucked. I did go in and pluck a little bit more, so I did experience some shedding. And right now, I just got one little strand. Of course, you probably can't see that. There it is. I just got one strand, but I think I just pulled that out. <laughs> but, yeah, I did get shedding from me plucking it and bleaching it. But other than that, it's holding up pretty good. I do plan on doing a... um. I guess an updated wig review of all these wigs because I've been getting a lot of questions about how they've been holding up and I'm just gonna answer y'all questions in one video <laughs> but yeah it takes color very very well um I did use 40 volume developer I was trying to get a lighter color than this so I'll probably go back and bleach it again but um this wig is it's taking a little bit longer to lift. The curly wig that I had, it literally lifted fast in like one spot. It got like so bright. <laughs> so I was really expecting that to happen with this one, but it didn't. But I mean, it's fine. Oh so yeah, if you have any more questions about this beautiful wig, please feel free, honey, to comment down below and I will answer your questions. And I'll insert pictures and videos right after this. But don't forget to like this video. It does help me out a lot. Comment if you have any questions. And subscribe. And yeah. And until then, I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys. I miss the trees. I miss the waves. Fly me up higher. Take me to the motherland. I've been away.